Hello, it's Skyla. I'm back and still as awkward as I was before, so I don't really know how to start this intro. We're gonna be doing a video on dyeing my eyebrows and my eyelashes. Um, disclaimer, this is not something I recommend people doing on their own at home by themselves. Just probably you shouldn't do it, so I'm gonna do it. <laughs> um, I don't have really eyebrows that you can see unless you get really close. And then the tips of my eyelashes are very blonde, and so I just look like a naked mole rat. But today we are going to fix that with some cheap, like, little life hacks. Because nowadays people will spend thousands of dollars to get eyelash extensions and microbladed eyebrows. And I'm not hating, a little bit jealous that I can't afford that. So we're going to go with the second best. Um, I have 1,000 hours eyelash dye in the color natural black i ordered this off amazon i'm pretty sure it was like 10 bucks you can use it on your eyebrows or your eyelashes it says 12 applications each application lasts up to six weeks it's 12 months supply i don't do this norm like regularly so i don't keep up on it i probably haven't done it in about like six months and the other thing we're going to be doing for the eyebrows is mustache dye this is like a beard mustache dye I actually got it at Walmart for like $4.98. It says just for men. This isn't the color that I use. Um, I use a darker color because my roots are dark. But this one is light brown. I go with uh, medium brown. So we're going to get started. If you decided to do this, although I don't advise it, I suggest you get some Vaseline to put on the skin around the area so you don't dye your skin. Some of these little like eyelash applicators you can buy like 25 of them for like six bucks off of amazon and then you need some q-tips and cotton balls and then obviously something to keep your hair out of your face so this is another close-up of what my eyebrows look like before i dye them as well as my eyelashes um so let's get started we're gonna get eyelashes not gonna look like a Naked mole rat. Not the most attractive look. Okay, so in this kit, it says poison. So let's put it by our eyes. Keep out of reach of children, read safety directions. Okay, so it comes like this. I've already used this set before. You can reuse it because everything is kind of like separated. It comes with the lash and brow dye liquid developer the actual dye color it comes with this little tray you can put it right here so it says to put um three drops oh okay so that was like three drops somewhere and then you're gonna take your dye and on the box it shows just putting it from one tip to the other you know it's kind of like cooking just free just free measure it don't use measuring cups and then it comes with a little mixing stick it looks like this it's kind of dirty but it's gross you're just gonna mix so this stuff literally every time i do it i'm like oh it's expired because it just doesn't mix in together properly it it looks gross look at it like <laughs> that does not <laughs> look like something you should put on your eyes so one thing i forgot to add is you can use like these under eye treatments. Um, this is it's a collagen and gold under eye mask. You can buy them literally anywhere. They're just like little pads that go to your eyes and this will keep it from getting um, dye on your skin right underneath your eyes. Dancing in my living room. Da -da -da. Okay, and then we're gonna take some of my Vaseline. Put it on your finger. And just rub it on your eyelid. Oh no, not on the eyelashes. And just rub it. This is very unflattering. Okay. Why am I doing this? I don't know. So you're gonna wanna take your little eyelash mascara wand and stroke the eyelashes in an upward motion. Like that. Do do. Okay. 
and get these little bottom lashes. Try not to poke my eye. Dancing in my living room. Okay. So, <laughs> get your eyelashes looking like, like spider legs. And then you just set your timer. Set timer for 15 minutes. Okay, your timer is set for 15 minutes. I'm just gonna chill here. Okay, so while that's going, while well, the eyelashes are baking, that sounds, that sounds good. So we're gonna start on the eyebrows, woo! It comes with the color and a color developer and this fancy dancy little plastic tray. So we're just gonna squirt some down in there. And then we're gonna squirt some of that right there. Oh, and by the way, if your eyes start to burn, that's normal. So you mix, just mix, 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 mix. So what you're gonna wanna do is just brush your eyebrows out, that's what I do. And then take your Vaseline because this will dye your skin and you will have ginormous eyebrows that are not only on the hair, but that are on the rest of your face. And this kind of gives you like an opportunity to kind of shape like where you want your eyebrows to be. So I just kind of go around the natural like shape of my eyebrow for the most part. Like this. I look like a bride to the bar. Or like a, a mad prom queen. And then you're gonna take your your eyebrow stuff. And just just put it on there. You know? Like that. <laughs> Okay, who else puts on mascara and is just like, like, I don't know why, it's like automatic, like my mouth always is just open when I put on mascara. I guess this is kind of the same thing. So it looks yellow right now, ew. And then you can kind of just brush it, and this is really dangerous, I'm literally doing this in like the viewfinder thing. I should probably look in the mirror. Dancing in my living room, oh god. And then we're gonna just chill like this. Okay, but I've been like dyeing my eyebrows since sophomore year of high school and um, sometimes they turn out really good and sometimes I look like a gay woman. Oh, I'm good. Like it's bad. Like it's really bad. So it's kind of just like a gamble every time I do it. Sometimes it's great, sometimes it's not. But you know, at the end of the day, they're just eyebrows and my eyes burn. Beauty is pain. Let's just wipe off the eyebrow. The eyelashes are still baking. By the way, it recommends you leave it on for five minutes. I didn't really think about the water water leaking into my eyeball. And now for the eyelashes. This part scares me because I don't want to get the poison in my eyes. Uh -huh. Uh -huh. Take that off. Uh, I'm just going to kind of rub it. Ow, ow. It doesn't hurt, but I'm waiting for it to hurt. This feels good. This is relaxing. This is nice. And I'm back with eyebrows <laughs> and eyelashes. So this is what they look like now. Um, my eyelashes, it's not a huge difference and my eyebrows are pretty dark. But over the next couple days, they will fade. And there's like this one week where it's like, optimum eyebrow game strong and they look really good but then they fade and the whole process goes all over again so I just dye my eyebrows to live for that one week and yeah <laughs> so um I personally think they look good I mean they obviously don't look like micro braided micro bladed eyebrows because I didn't change the structure of my eyebrow I just dyed my not the hairs that I already have there I really appreciate having them in the morning when I wake up I just get a look in the mirror and be like who's that with the with the eyebrows over there. Real, like, blondes will understand the ones that were born with uh, no eyebrows. So I definitely feel more confident than me earlier when I was looking like the naked mole rat from Kim Possible. Um, side note, this is why I put Vaseline around my face, like all over my face, because it'll dye your skin. And I'm just gonna have these weird brown markings all over me until it decides to fade. I got it on my nail. As you can see, I'm messy. I think that's eyelash dye that one's black and that's brown so you can wear gloves while doing this but yeah like I said I'm gonna be posting more videos now I hope 
I can keep to my word because I procrastinate and I put a lot of things off. But seriously, if you guys have any good ideas or suggestions, just drop them below. And I will see you in my next video. Have a good day.